I came in one day and there was a notice on the honours room door that Western Mining were having interviews the next day. And I thought, oh, Western Mining, a big company, uh, they only highlight first class honours. So I have much of a chance with them. And I thought, oh, I'll put my name down and just come in for a practice interview, see yeah. how I go. So I think there was like eight of us in the honours class, people like Matt Ducey, who run an IGO, Alan Neeshaw, who discovered him, yeah. a few other people. So I came in, went into the interview. I think I was probably the last or second last person to do the interview. And other guys had been coming out. Didn't seem like they were done very well. And I went in and there was a person, Megan Clark, who's pretty well known. She was the first female underground mine geo, Western Mining. She went on to run CSIRO, head up the space agency. She was doing the interviews. She was a, the yeah. well, chief, chief geoscientist for Western Mining at the time. So she said, oh, well, tell us about your honest project. And I said, I'm looking at nickel geochemistry and regular mapping and stratigraphy and telling about the project. And about 10 minutes in, she goes, oh, I don't think well, I need to hear anymore. I thought, okay, I'll get ready to walk out. The door. She goes, I think we can offer you a job. All right. Okay. And just so happened that there were three geochemists who were moving spots. And back then in Western mining, basically every exploration team, she described it as like the perfect fishing trip. You had a few geos, you had a geochemist and you had a geophysicist and a more sort of technical structural geologist in each team. Yeah. And people used to move around every few years. And it just so happened that there were a couple of spots that opened up in these teams. There was a, a spot at Hill 50 in Mount Magna. It was a spot in the northeastern gold fields in the nickel team there. And there was a spot in the Murchison Pilbara team. So I said, I think we should set you up for the meeting with the chief geochemist, a guy called Richie Carver. Yeah. So I met up with him and showed him what I was working on the project. And he said, oh, that's really good. I ended up choosing the Murchison Pilbara team. They were based in Belmont. So I didn't even have to move house. 